Assalamualaikum like YouTube and welcome to another video of Paggy Kicks. This here is Sebeer and uh, today for you guys I'm gonna bring you a long awaited video uh, from my end because I haven't uploaded in quite a long time. I do apologize for that just you know life got a little busy for me but we're back to bring you a video of the Air Jordan Retro 1 in the yellow toe or taxi colorway. Um, this Air Jordan is uh, pretty much a long awaited colorway. We've been waiting for Jordan brand for a while now to bring you out a uh, black, yellow, and uh, you know, creamish color colorway in like the black toe color blocking. Jordan Brand did last year bring out the Pollen Air Jordan ones, but receiving them in hand, they were just kind of a little bit underwhelming in my opinion. Um, I just think they weren't what I was kind of expecting. The shade of yellow was very different from I think this type of shade of yellow. And um, I mean, they were a cool shoe, but just nothing that I kept in my collection. And um, by the time I wanted to get rid of them, I found out that these were coming out. And uh, I definitely want to get these more than the uh, uh, the ones from last year. Getting into the shoe itself right here, pretty much it's a basic Air Jordan 1. Obviously, everything you've seen in the past done numerous amounts of time. Um, the main thing that stands out for this shoe is that you have the hints of this very nice yellow color or taxi they're calling it here in this case um so as you see you have taxi on the heel side and the top we have our black wings logo right here and then our toe here again is of this taxi color and then at the very bottom the outsole our regular jordan one traction right here in that taxi color we have our nike air in the center again jordan ones have probably one of the best tractions for any sort of jordan model ever so that's a good touch and then um again we have our regular black leather here all throughout the shoe and the toe cap as well as um, on the eye stays right here as well uh we have some cream leather or sail in this case in the mid side of the shoe as on the middle side you see again a nice creamish um leather uh the midsole here has this nice uh cream uh paint to it or color to it as you guys can see and then for our tongue, our tongue has this very nice black mesh tongue right here. Uh, and then on the top where it says Nike Air, it's in that taxi yellow color with a white background stitching. Uh, and then for the laces, the shoe does come with black laces. And then again, we have our little black plastic eye tips right here. Surprisingly for this Air Jordan 1, it only comes with one set of lace, which is black. Um, very strange because I would expect Jordan ones to come with a spare laces like this one could easily use a another like taxi color lace or even a white lace in this case but they didn't pack that in for this uh, Jordan which is very very surprising to me I really do hope that this is not something going forward because having an extra lace option was very nice to include with this shoe right here and then um the inside of the shoe, the sock liner is our typical Air Jordan 1 sock liner right here. It's in all black and it feels very nice. It's like this neoprene material if I'm not mistaken, but just very nice and soft to the touch. The uh, insole here is this taxi colored insole as you guys can see. And it has Nike Air in black lettering. And um, pretty much that's the shoe right here. Um, for the box itself, the box is different from our standard Air Jordan 1 box. As you guys can see with this all over yellow taxi colored box with black Nike um, branding right here all throughout the box. The uh, sizing tag does read, again, Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG Taxi Black Sale. And um, I got the shoe early from N Clothing. That's why I was able to get the shoe a month before the release date because overseas, the shoe has already pretty much released. But just in the US, we're still getting, or North America, we're just waiting for a release there. These are gonna come out in North America on September 24th. Uh, retail is gonna be 170 US dollars. And um, overall, I do think this shoe is definitely worth the price. Currently, resale for this shoe is not going for a lot. I've been seeing on GOAT for around like 220 to 240 ish. So that's absolutely not bad at all for a Jordan 1 that's still about a month away from release date. My recommendation though is that if you guys really do want the shoe, I would just probably wait until the release date because I definitely do think there's going to be a lot of pairs of these available in the North American markets. And um, just judging from the low resale value already to begin with, um, there definitely was a lot of pairs probably available overseas as well. So, I mean, if you guys really, really want it, I would go ahead and go for it. But I would just personally wait and just save yourself that $60, $50. I'm just very surprised that Jordan Brand does release these like 
yellow colors so late in the summertime because these always seem to be more so the spring colored or summertime sneakers so very surprising but in the end still glad to get them early still glad to get that early dub on the shoe a uh, big shout out again to end clothing once again and um i definitely love the shoe a lot but in the comments please let me know what you guys do think of the air jordan one do you guys like this shoe or do you guys are tired of the air jordan one model uh let me know in the comments below also please get make sure to hit the subscribe button for me as well as the like button for me i really appreciate you guys did that it has been my first video in a few months so um i'm hoping to be more consistent in the channel and just continue you guys that content once there's certain sneakers or even hats that i picked up um come up down the line i'll definitely make sure to provide that content for you guys and um once again follow me on all my social media at haseeb underscore me on instagram and twitter uh, i appreciate you guys did that for me and uh once again i will see you guys on the next video peace